What up guys, Knoxville 363 I'm going to be doing a short review on the application Vlingo. It is free on the marketplace for any Android device. And if you're wondering what Vlingo is, it is comparable to Siri for the iPhone. It's a voice commanded application that you can make your phone, uh, make so you can send text messages, call people, find places, you do like GPS type stuff. You can update your Facebook, Twitter, and social networking. Just various things like that. That helps you when you're perhaps like you know when you're driving or something. And you don't really have time to be staring at your phone. Well, all you gotta do is open up the application. You hit speak it, and you basically tell your phone what you want it to do. And if you ever need help with, okay, well, I want to update my Twitter. How do I do that? Because I keep getting errors. Well, you scroll down. Obviously, when you're, when you're, this is for like first time users such as myself. If you're looking to just update your social networks, it'll tell you what keywords you need to say. And those are highlighted in blue. So if you want to update your Facebook, you need to say Facebook. And then you say what you want to put on your status or location or I don't know whatever you would want to put on your Facebook if you want to update your Twitter you need to be be specific and say Twitter and then your message and then it'll open up your Twitter and all you have to do is hit tweet so let's do a couple examples and that works for directions too uh, directions are pretty easy you just put find and then whatever store you're looking for so let's give it a couple shots okay let's do Walmart find Walmart and what I have found that you need to do is when it says speak into it, you need to be give it a second before you start talking into it and you can see how quick the results popped up I'm not I'm only on my 3g as you can tell from the top I'm not on Wi-Fi and it'll just give you all the Walmarts that are in your vicinity obviously from the closest all the way down to the furthest from you okay obviously I wouldn't want to drive 23 miles to Walmart but anyways so now let's try Twitter Twitter I'm making a YouTube video and there it is and all I have to do is hit tweet and it'll add it this new tweet onto my Twitter without me ever opening up my application and physically typing that in myself um, and it works for text messaging as well and calling but I will tell you guys right now I didn't really play with it all that much this evening however if you have people by nicknames or non common names like Matt or Bob or John well your phone's gonna have a tough time trying to make basically pull up that person's name like one of my buddies his last name is Anderson and I have him stored in in my phone by his last name so when I tested it and put like text Logan or uh, text Anderson mobile or call Anderson mobile it wouldn't pull up his name because this program was looking for Anderson with an S O N at the end so in that respect that's the reason why I think that this application needs a little bit of work um, however it is free so I mean what do you expect it will have errors with it just like anything else but anyway so I know a couple people sent me private messages asking me if there was anything similar to Siri and this was the best that I could find I do recommend everybody check it out let me know what you guys think of it like I said it does have its mistakes however I could definitely see how this application can be useful so thank you guys for watching this video feel free to leave a comment below for other people and let me know and everyone else what you guys think of this application thanks